Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Tenet, and if you're returning, my name is Bestie. So in today's vlog, I'm taking you guys on my ski trip. It's my first time ski. Oh my god, you scared me. I didn't realize you were in it. It's okay, you could be in it. It's my first time skiing. Um, I even wore this sweatshirt that I got from Primark that says ski something something to get into the spirit. Um, this is Amanda. Hey. Yeah, Why this is Olivia. <laughs> I'm so excited to go skiing. I haven't gone skiing in years. Yeah, and this is Penelope if you want to be on camera. Oh shit, I'm eating chips, but <laughs> never seen. I'm gonna be busting my ass, but we'll see. Yay! White Claw. Um, they don't know it yet, but they're sponsored this whole trip. Yeah, they we spent a good amount of money on them. So, ergo, they're the sponsor. In it Manifesting a White Claw partnership. <laughs> <laughs> So we have officially made it to the resort. Right now I'm just waiting to check in to my room and then of course when I get into my room, I'm going to do a room tour. So, um, see you later. Hey, 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 I am currently in my room now. I got settled in. I had to use the bathroom really, 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 really bad. Um, yeah, I had to use the bathroom really bad. Got my little pass on for my job. The theme is like freeze fest, kind of like, you know, like a, a ice snow ski festival situation. About to get ready to go to dinner. I'm supposed to actually be there right now. But this is the fit that I'm wearing. I'm wearing these jeans from Zara, which are like my favorite jeans in the whole world. Um, this turtleneck from Primark. I feel like I may have worn it before. I'm not sure. Um, and I'm probably wearing Uggs. I'm definitely wearing Uggs. It's really, really cold outside. Um, but yeah, that's the fit. This is the room. I actually have two beds. My friend was actually supposed to be coming with me but um they are unfortunately sick so now i have the room to myself hope they feel better um this is the couch it's a couch or whatever yeah just a couch don't know if i'm gonna sit on it we'll see um another seating area looks like it's made for breakfast some drawers i'm gonna pack my stuff and probably put them in the drawers so they're easier to find but i'm honestly wearing like one fit so we'll see um <laughs> yeah microwave fridge let's see if anything's in the fridge guys nothing okay it's all right it's all good um cool paintings you know and the bathroom oh some shelves stuff the bathroom isn't anything special guys it's really basic as hell yeah i might talk to you at dinner big might we shall see um, depending on the vibe and everything. I want to be respectful of everyone's privacy and whatnot. So I'll see you guys in a few. My favorite vlogger has given me her camera. All right. This is camera. So what should I do? What should I do? What should I film? What should I capture? Cheers. Cheers. You do a sweet big shot about it. So like, no, 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 listen, listen, listen. So like Indian wedding videos are exclusively that. It's, we, it's literally the wedding and then shots of the cameraman will just go around the whole wedding party filming people eating. It's exactly what I'm doing right now. That's literally all it is. No, it's crazy and it's uncomfortable. Uh, I, I guess so. Um... Just took a shower, just washed my face, did my whole, you know, nighttime routine, put my hair up. Um, yeah, I'm watching the game, I'm chilling. Um, Sophia might come to my room, but we'll see. Um, I'm tired ish. Like, tired ish. It's like when I was on the bus, like, I was really, really tired. But once I got here and I ate and I drank, I was like, you know. 
I'm just relaxed. You know, there's one thing to be tired and there's another thing to be relaxed. Relax is like, you know, you're just chilling. Like, I'm just chilling, enjoying the vibe of this, you know, vacation situation. Um, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. I'm probably just going to lay in the bed for the rest of the night watching the game or whatever. Um, yeah, I'm streaming from Amazon Prime my phone to the TV so I have a lot of options you can also stream from Netflix and stuff so shout out to the updated hotel technology for that um also y'all you see my lips right my lips look extra moisturized right and that is thanks to Laneige right so I lost my oh let me actually say lost I misplaced my Laneige lip mask like over a month plus ago right um, I knew it was in my apartment. I knew it was in my apartment, but I didn't know where it was. I knew it wasn't in my room and it wasn't in my bathroom, but I didn't think like, wait, it might be in your mom's room, right? Sorry, I had a fuzz on my lip. And yesterday I just went into my mom's room and there was sitting on her, on her um, dresser back to moisturized lips. So, yeah, back to moisturized lips. Yeah, your favorite YouTuber likes to take risks. Yes, I take risks and I like to have fun. Like, one thing about me, I try to never put myself in a situation where I'm like, okay, that's too scary, I'm never gonna do it. Unless it's like skydiving or something like that. But like, when I went to Ghana, I went to Cancun National Park, I'm gonna post a picture right here for you guys. And it's a bunch of seven drawstring bridges in the rainforest. Okay, seven, seven of them. The first bridge, I psyched myself up. I was like, no, I can't do this. I can't do this. I can't do this. I'm scared. I can't do it. I can't do it. And guess what? I did it. And now I got the story to tell. So whenever I leave my comfort zone, literally going to another country, going to another state or another town or something like that, I like to come back saying, at least I tried, right? On my diversity, my third diversity, I would say. I went rock climbing, right? It was hard, it was scary, but I tried and I did it. And at least I can say I did it. So that's like my motto, you know? The best things in life are on the other side of fear. I always say this, if you know me, that is literally my life's motto, you know? So I just try to push myself out my comfort zone just so I can say I tried, you know? Like my therapist told me like, give yourself that, um, first try you know everyone and everything deserves a first try you have to give yourself the opportunity and that grace for a first try because without the first try how will you ever know you know um but that's about it so this is my breakfast i got some turkey bacon potato tops eggs with cheese and a turkey sausage yeah. thank you And I got my goggles fixed. My friend fixed them for me. So let me put them on. Okay. Now I'm waiting on my ski shuttle to take me to my lessons. And I might vlog that, but I actually really want to focus. So. We'll see about that. Um, but it's cold. But hold on. Can you Let's get it. Let's get it. Nee, nee, nee. Wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna just. Ooh. <laughs> Land. Let's get it. Ha, 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 ha. Thank you. In the meantime, I just finished my ski lessons. I'm deciding if I want to go in the bunny slope or not just because it seems very, very steep and I'm hearing that it's fast. It's very fast. Um, so I checked off the one thing that I wanted to do today, which was ski. You know, it doesn't matter which level of skiing I'm going to do. I skied. 
you know i didn't have to go down a really steep slope that was not my goal my goal was to actually do the activity presented to me so i didn't fold on myself so i'm proud of myself um i would like to introduce you all to bana this is bana also a first timer how would you describe your experience scary <laughs> <laughs> It's fun. I'm scared. <laughs> How y'all doing? Good. Good. Just dropped off my equipment. I am finally back in my regular walking boots. Boy, my ankles are so stiff. So, so stiff. Look how high these mountains go. Hold on. So guys, I actually want y'all to see how steep these slopes go. So unfortunately, I was not able to get in the lift because in order to get on the lift, you have to be able to ski back down. And clearly, I cannot ski back down. I can't, you see there's somebody skiing right there. I am not that talented or skilled with skiing yet. Like it goes so high. No wonder why they call it Camelback Mountain because it's literally like a camel's back. Wow, it's a beautiful view. It is a beautiful view. Um, one day, one day, guys. One day. I'm gonna try to vlog while I'm on it. We'll see. The first ride down, probably not, because I don't know how the speed is gonna be. But yeah. Okay, <laughs> so this is Alexi. Alexi is one of my loyal, loyal, loyal subscribers as well. <laughs> yes! So I just wanted to shout her out IRL. And we are walking to dinner right now. Um, yeah, that's it. Yes. It's a long walk. Literally, long walk. now I know why it's called Trails End because it's literally the end <laughs> of, the of the trail <laughs> of this long ass walk. <laughs> Hello, hopefully the food is delicious this time. Oh, we'll still not have too high hopes. Freeze frame. <laughs> Getting ready to go to the water park. It's my swimsuit. Hold on, let me zoom in so y'all can really see. Like, I got this from Target. The shorts are really large on me, but it's all good. This is the back. This is the back. She's cute. Um, yeah, it was so cute. I think I paid $41 for everything um, because it was a sale. Was it everything? Or did I get something else? I don't remember. But it was a sale. So, yeah, that's it. I'll hit you guys up when I get to the water park. I saw and I pumped out. I did not want to go on the water slides because I did not know the trails of the water slides because some of them go out and I don't know where they're going outside. I don't know if they're flipping outside. I don't know if it's loop -de -loop tying a shoelace outside. I didn't want to take the risk. And this is my first time in a hot tub outdoors. It is currently 40 degrees and I'm in a hot tub. This is insane. Dude. Um, it is the 10th of March. Um, it is also almost like 9 o'clock, probably like 9 or 2. Um, I'm waiting on the bus to head back to the city. Um, I'm actually looking forward to going home because I just want a home cooked meal. I really just want a home cooked meal. I want some rice, I want some gravy of some sort, some soup of some sort, maybe pepper soup. I don't know. It's actually going to storm this week, so pepper soup might be the right thing to make this week. Um. Um.